having Plymouth to come and play is that they believe in good old attacking football. It's not easy for the home team, but it makes for a match worth watching. Oxford looked a lot sharper, a lot stronger on Saturday. Mark Steen in particular tried desperately hard to find a route to goal. United took the lead on 14 minutes. An absolute beauty from Kerry Evans, his first for Oxford. What a way to start. Another Oxford hero was goalkeeper Paul Key. How about this for a save to celebrate your home debut? Plymouth kept pushing though and were unlucky not to get a goal from this attack. The next time they moved forward, they did get a goal. Andy Thomas, an old man ground hero, bulldozed his way past Foster and then finished off brilliantly. In the second half, the running of Byrne on the right caused a few problems, but Key solved most of them. David Penny back in the team did a grand job and so too did substitute Paul Simpson as he ran in for the second goal. Back at the other end, Plymouth proved they weren't beaten yet, but neither was Key, as he saved again from Thomas. But Oxford do make life hard for themselves. A goal here, and they would have been home and dry. Plymouth were never out of it. The United defence wobbled at times. And fell apart when Jimmy Phillips made a terrible mess of a back pass. A clear penalty, and Tommy Tynan doesn't miss chances like these. With just five minutes to go, United got the winner. There was real drama as Plymouth cleared one off the line. And a fabulous finale as Jimmy Phillips headed the third goal. Five-star entertainment. <laughs> 